Today, your girl is coming at you bare face because today is all about spring cleaning and kitchen organization. I am totally on the floor, like having a Trisha Paytas moment. Not really, but you get what I mean. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel, or hello, my name is Kayla if you are new here. Today, your girl is coming at you bare face because today is all about spring cleaning and kitchen organization. I recently went to stores like Walmart, TJ Maxx, uh, where else did I go? The Dollar Tree, and I also picked a few things up from Marshalls, so if this is something you are interested in doing in your own home, it is very affordable. You do not have to spend a ton of money. I'm very excited about today's video, so I want to jump right in and quit rambling. If you like these videos, please give it a big thumbs up. Also, please consider subscribing before you leave, and let's get started. Okay, so I damn near had like a dance party because you don't know how many times I had to redo that intro i'd say a good eight to ten times um if you hear any like clicking or oh shit or any that's derek he's playing video games don't mind him but i'm gonna quickly show you guys the pieces that i picked up these i picked up from walmart they were 96 cents each um these are gonna be used in my fridge I already have some of these, but I love love them. Um, this one, I'm not sure if I'm going to be using. I got this one from Burlington. Oh, yeah, I forgot to tell you guys I went to Burlington, too. But um, this one I already had. There was old cereal that we never ate. It was just kind of sitting in there. So I'm not sure if I'm going to be using this. We'll see. This I showed you guys in my haul video. So I got that. And then I picked this one up from the Dollar Tree. I have this one. And this I picked up from Burlington along with this guy and this guy, which these, for how nice they are, they were pretty affordable. I think they were. this one was $4.99, this one was $5.99, and then this one was $6.99. But I love the lids on them. Sorry, that's loud. And then I pick this guy up. Look how stinking cute that is. I don't know what I'm gonna use it for, but I had to have it. Um, this one was $3.99. So stinking cute. I think I'm gonna put oatmeal in it and keep it out on the counter. Like this deserves to be out on the counter, not, you know, put away. And then these for the fridge. So I'm gonna quickly show you, I'm gonna be using Mrs. Myers. I got some sponges just in case and some rags and I'm gonna be using some Clorox wipes and then I have this bag here because if there is any food that I no longer want but someone can eat it, I'm gonna be giving it to a homeless guy who comes into my work so that's what this bag is for and then everything else will go in the trash. So yeah, these are the products I'm gonna be using. And then I'm gonna show you what our fridge is looking like right now. So. Yeah, it's a little all over the place. There is some organizational pieces like this, but my yogurt's kind of, I we just went grocery shopping by the way, so I felt like this is the perfect time to do this. And then, yeah, more yogurt in there, and then his Powerade's in here. But yeah, um, I have an egg thing already, and then leftovers. The apple juice needs to be thrown away, and then his sunny days are in here and Capri Suns are in here. And then this is what, who else has a drawer of sauces from fast food places? Uh, yeah, that needs to get handled. And then that's what our door is looking like. I'm going to pull everything out and clean the surfaces and then reorganize it. And then this is what our drawers, just not very organized, okay? We don't have a pantry like I mentioned. We keep our cereals up top and then this is basically our pantry right here. And then we also have a little, girl don't even get me started. Like this is a hot freaking mess. I don't like the way 
that looks right okay so this is what our cabinets look like i love these baskets i find that's what our top so this is fairly organized i highly recommend this for cans and then i also have an extra few extra things so yeah and then i tried organizing down here the best i could but it's just there's some wasted space here and I want to kind of redo things in here so yeah and I have containers back there but it's just not the way I want it I want this in a container I want like our pancake mix in a container and stuff like that so we will see so I'm gonna clear all the containers to one side and then basically pull everything out of the fridge I'm gonna start with the fridge first and then, um, yeah, go from there. Stay high for the most of time. Meet a stranger, jump right in your car. Waking up on your sofa. Next to half your bottles from last night. If you wanna leave this town, baby, I'm lost, I'm fading now. Baby, I'm lost, I'm fading now. Tell me if you wanna go sometime. Yeah, we could be alone. Okay, so look at all of this bullshit. Okay, so uh, the stuff is on the ground over there. But I took out everything for the most part. I still need to take those out, but look. How filthy, you guys. Like, look at that. Oh my god. Oh my god. Yeah, so I'm gonna take those off, pull those out. The only thing I'm worried about is, okay, you see that? This glass piece, I don't know what that is. I have no idea what that is. I think it's something that's spilt, but that glass piece does not come out of this so i don't know how i'm going to clean that out but i'm gonna wash these and wash all of these before i put everything back in tell me if you wanna go sometime yeah we could be alone tonight baby i'm lost i'm fading now okay who else gets this in their fridge do you guys see that Ew, gross. It's like dried up milk. It always comes from the milk. Baby, I'm lost, I'm fading now. Baby, I'm lost, I'm fading now. wasn't there before. What do you mean before? When we moved in. You sure? Yeah. Okay, well, it might have been brand new at that point, and now it's oxidized or whatever and changed color. I don't Okay, my hair 
there's a freaking wreck, but it's whatever. I have this container left that I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with. I still have the cabinets to do, but yeah. I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like. So, um, I, ha I use this container for um, his Lunchables. And then I use this to pull out, like if we need butter or sour cream. And then I have salsa and hummus back there. And then in this drawer, I these are extra olives from our leftovers. And then lettuce and cheese back there. And then in this drawer, I these are extra olives from our leftovers. And then lettuce and cheese. I love the way that looks. So there's that. And then I stacked our leftovers up like that. This was down here. Um, I was gonna put our leftovers in here, so if we wanted our leftovers, we could just pull it out, but I feel like we don't constantly have leftovers in our fridge, so I just felt like it made sense to put them back. And I just threw my um, honeydew melon in here. This container I actually already have. I have another one too, but that is what it's looking like. Okay, the fridge is done and now I'm moving on to the bottom portion of our cabinets. Um, I'm just gonna pull everything out, kind of do the same process for everything else and, and figure out what I want to go in each container and then organize accordingly. So I'm just gonna like put music over this and then you guys can watch me do what I'm doing. charge but I finished behind me there's a little sneak peek I am totally on the floor like having a Trisha Paytas moment not really but you get what I mean so I'm gonna quickly show you what the finished product looks like oh it looks so good um so yeah I'm super excited I'm gonna show you look you guys I moved two baskets up here and it's just got extra peach cups and like you know those pasta packets and then I did all of our beef jerky and a few popcorn packets I moved that container that was on the counter down here it's just got Chex Mix in it I had one box of spaghetti noodles and then I moved our box like sides down here I thought that was a really good space for them instead of having them lined up here these baskets were down here but oh my god you guys I'm loving it so I moved our potato flakes and this container we have some bow tie pasta and back there I just have cup of noodles and some spaghetti noodles and then this peanut container I'm gonna take the label off that but I just don't have the patience nor time right now this is taking all day you guys okay then I lined up the best thing on earth in this container um, so I did find a spot to use that and then I put his like fruit roll-ups and stuff in this wide container and then my peanuts in there I have some big marshmallows and then the rest of my smoothie powder back there and then I put all of our Ritz um, little packets in this container I love it in there instead of just 
seeing everything down there. I'm still not done with that area, but um, yeah, it looks so much better in there. So moving on to all of this. So for the most part, it's fairly organized, so this will be pretty quick. I'm just going to put all my oatmeal into this container right here, um, transfer this into a container, and my granola into that container up there. And then these oats will also go in here and then I'll have these two free. And then I'm gonna put some chocolate chips in this little mason jar. And then, yeah, I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with this. Ooh, I haven't even started my coffee. <sighs> you guys, I need one. This is taking forever. And I'm not just like exaggerating either. Like I've been doing this all day. I did get a little bit of a late start, but I definitely started 11.30 noon and it's like five o'clock already. Like if you plan on doing this, clear out your day, make sure it's a day that you're not doing anything. Cause girl, you're gonna have time to do and not a goddamn thing, okay? I'm going to start my coffee. And I look a hot mess, you guys. I have to wash my hair. Anyways, this isn't a hair video. This is a... I didn't even put the freaking coffee cup in there, you guys. It's just water. And my sugar is already in there. God damn. Okay, you guys. So, I am done. That was a lot quicker than I thought it was going to be. I ended up moving these up here for easy access. And then in these, I just have some popcorn and then the smaller popcorns and then some Pop-Tarts in here. Um, and then I moved the bow ties up here because I was gonna have like one in front of the other, but I just don't think that looks like aesthetically pleasing. Then this was below and I had these two like in front, but like the way that looks and then up top is pretty much the same. I just added the breadcrumbs. I love these baskets. You can find them at Walmart for 96 cents for three. And then that is some homemade um, pizza sauce that a friend gave me. And yeah, that is what all of that is looking like. And then, don't mind my kitchen, it's a mess. I moved the oatmeal over here. I think that looks so cute. And yeah. And as far as this right here, we just have tortillas and then sandwich bags in there. And then I have, um, actually those are like freezer bags and then these are sandwich bags and I have some uh, rice cakes and then my pretzels in here and then just some chips which honestly these barbecue and sour cream and onion I'm gonna give those to the guy who comes into my work and then those are just tortilla chips and these once they're gone and eaten up um I'm not gonna buy those anymore just because it doesn't look good so yeah these are extra but I'll find another place for them and then I also don't mind this mess here. I'm gonna give these to the guy also and the rest of this Chex Mix as well because we don't need all that Chex Mix. So I'm gonna give these to him and what did I say? I can give him those chips too actually. Oh yeah, and those chips. So I'm gonna put that stuff in a bag. This needs to go in the garage. So I put all this stuff in the, the bag. Um, for the gentleman at my work and that is what it is looking like so far i just yeah i'm gonna give you guys one whole overview again so everything looks really good I had to take my hair down because I was tired of looking at a greasy um, bun. I need to wash my hair today. Like, 
I'm not even gonna let you know how many days it's been. Um, I hope you guys like this video. Um, I had a lot of fun doing it. It was a lot of work and took way longer than expected, but it needed to be done filming it or not. So I hope this gave you the motivation to maybe organize your kitchen or pantry. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you guys next time. Stay